Hi guys, it's Katie, so welcome to part... 7? 8? I don't know what part we're on. Katie, so welcome to part 7 of my breakfast journal series. Um, we're already on part 7. I'm really excited because I actually got filming done early today. Woohoo! It's Tuesday when I'm filming this, so it'll be all ready to upload tomorrow afternoon. And yay, because I've been behind lately with my videos, so I'm happy that I'm finally on track again. Anyway, in this week's video, we were getting really messy with some paint. Uh, I had a lot of fun doing the pages this week. It was a big mess, but I think the pages turned out pretty cool. Uh, so before we get into the video, if you're new here, be sure to press that subscribe button so you guys can see more videos from me. I upload every Wednesday and Saturday. Uh, also click that little bell icon if you want to be notified every time I upload. Uh, but that's about it, so um, let's just jump right into the video, you guys. So the first page I'm going to be doing is the copyright and warning page. So I'm just going to start out with taking some watercolor paints and I'm going to paint the bottom yellow and then I'm going to paint the top with a red and then in the middle I'm just going to kind of mix the two colors together to make a pretty little sunset. And this is what it'll look like so I'm just going to wait for those watercolors to dry before I continue the next step. So now I'm just taking some black acrylic paint and I'm going to paint on a palm tree silhouette. I don't know about you guys, but palm trees just remind me of summer. Like, I don't even live near palm trees, but they just feel like summer and warmth. <laughs> Painting this is a lot of fun. I used a really thin brush to get the wispy mist of the leaves, and I think it turned out pretty good. And that's how it turned out. I just really followed the lines to make the leaves and I think it looks pretty good. The next one was throw something, a pencil or a ball dipped in paint. And this one was actually a lot of fun. I actually took some marbles I had laying around and I rolled those in three different colors of paint. Then I just threw them at the page. These do kind of like roll. So I set up some paper so I wouldn't mess up my entire desk. They also are really slippery and you're gonna get messy. But this is what it looked like after I finished throwing a few times. It rolled off onto the paper a lot. And it kind of rolled around the book too because I had this just laying on my desk because I didn't want to throw marbles covered in paint all over my room. So the last page we're doing is stand here. So I just put my feet down on the journal and I took some paint on a brush and I just kind of flicked it. I wanted to get like all the paint around my feet 
so that like there's like just a blank spot where my feet are this was a giant mess I got paint all over my feet I was just taking a ton of different shades of blue and then I lifted them off and you can kind of see like the prints but it didn't look that good to me so I painted the bottom of my foot with pink and red and I pressed it down in those open spots and you know why not just make a bigger mess since I already am a mess. <laughs> Yay, but this is how it turned out, guys. I cannot believe we've already completed 22 pages. That is insane. Welcome back. So I hope you guys enjoyed my breakfast journal for this week. I had a lot of fun making the pages and painting them. It got pretty messy. As you can see, the back of my journal now has paint on it, but you know, whatever, I guess that gives it a little bit of character. So if you guys like this video and you're enjoying this series, please give this video a big thumbs up so I can make some more content for you guys. Also, be sure to leave a comment down below on what pages you guys want to see me do next. I think that's all I have for you guys, so I will see you on Saturday for another DIY, and I'll see you back next Wednesday for another, another Wreck This Journal. Bye!